All right. Uh, thanks for coming and thanks for tuning in. With Plaid, we, we've managed to break the, uh, the, the two-second barrier, if you will. The, no, no production car has ever uh, done zero to 60 in under two seconds. Uh, in addition to uh, a crazy performance, uh, it's also got a long range. Uh, even with the uh, tri-motor uh, high performance, it's got almost a 400-mile range. And in the dual motor configuration, it's got a 412 mile range. And we've also improved the super supercharging speed, so you can uh, get 187 miles of range in 15 minutes. In terms of additional stats, uh, it's also the, the fastest production car to complete a quarter mile, so 9.23 seconds. Uh, it's got a 200 mile an hour top speed, uh, a thousand, over 1,000 horsepower, almost 400 mile range, like I said, uh, charges. Uh, so fast, uh, you, you know, it'll be probably done by the time you have a coffee, basically. Uh, we have an, an all-new battery pack. Um, and then something we're really proud of is the new carbon-sleeved rotors for the motor. And this is, it's single speed from zero to 200 miles an hour. I mean, you can pick this motor up with your hands, and, and it can accelerate a two-ton car to 60 miles an hour in two seconds. It goes up to tw uh, 20,000 RPM and maybe a little more. We also were able to achieve the uh, lowest drag coefficient of any car ever made. We also have the latest uh, and greatest uh, in heat pump, which is the, basically the HVAC system for the car. Uh, it's 30% better cold weather range uh, and requires 50% less energy for cabin heating in freezing conditions. Um, and the radiator is uh, twice as big for heat rejection. So you'll be able to actually do back-to-back -back 0 to 60s, um, go on the track, just whole ass, and uh, as you'll see tonight, this car is just going to be over and over again, and it doesn't get winded. And then it's, it's also engineered for uh, maximum safety as well. So uh, we think we can uh, get the, the lowest probability of injury of any car ever tested. And then the design, we've obviously made a lot of refinements to the exterior, and, and then we've, made, we've completely redone the interior. Um, as you can see, we changed the orientation of the main screen, so it's easier to watch movies and that kind of thing um, in landscape. In other notes, we have ventilated front seats. <laughs> um, we, we have the, this yoke steering wheel, which is a little different, but I think once you try it, you'll think this is, it's, it's great. The visibility uh, of the, the, the main screen is, is super clear, especially for uh, autopilot, so you can see the entire panoramic view. Like, you know, I think generally um, all input is error. So we, we want, if, if you have to do something that the car could have done already, the, the, that should be taken care of. The software should just do it. So you can actually just literally walk up to the car. It senses that you're approaching, unlocks the car based on your phone. It just basically pairs with your phone, knows that you're coming to the car, opens the door, it op op extends the handle, you sit down, and you just drive. You don't, you don't have to uh, press the drive or anything like that. The car knows you want to drive. It'll, it will just keep uh, minimizing the amount of input that you need to do until the car just reads your mind. So it's going to be great. Uh, we've re redesigned the... The we moved the interior so that the, the front IP is actually uh, slimmer and thinner, so we were able to move the, uh, the, the front seats forward, giving more room to the back seat. And we uh, reclined the back seat more and uh, reduced the interior trim. Dual inductive charges uh, for your phones in the back and dual inductive in the, uh, in the front. Similar to the, the Model 3 and, and Y, um, we, in, instead of having air vents, uh, we use intersecting uh, columns of air. So, and we just vary the, uh, the speed of the air. And then the 17 inch touchscreen is, it feels like a, a movie theater. The, the sound is incredible. Uh, we, we have an all new uh, sound system designed by Tesla Audio. Um, with, uh, and we have acoustic glass throughout the car. So the car is very quiet when going down the highway. Even at very high speeds, like you're like doing like 100 miles an hour, it's still quiet. And then we've got an all new UI. Uh, so. <laughs> So uh, anyway, the UI is uh, like basically easy to move around, uh, expand, contract, uh, shift music to the left, to, to the right, um, and we're going to keep improving it. So uh, it basically feels like a, like a modern tablet or phone. And then uh, <laughs> it's not, PS, not PS4, it's PS5. <laughs> it can play cyberpunk. So the, I think this really illustrates the difference. It maintains uh, 1,000 horsepower all the way up to uh, uh, 200 miles an hour. All right, and deliveries begin now. Yeah. So.
So we're, we're in production. Uh, we're going to deliver the first uh, 25 cars now, and uh, uh, and then basically we should be at uh, you know several hundred cars per week soon, and a thousand cars a week probably next quarter. My hat is off to Tesla Engineering Production Design, the whole the whole the whole group. Uh, they really they put their uh, heart and soul into this. So uh, hope hope you enjoy it. So let's uh, deliver some cars. <laughs>